boring now. in time out. like not to have anywhere to stay. It's a good thing these Sable agents have body armor, because I just might lose my temper.
Well, that was educational. Thank you. I was so scared. Captain, the people that were locked up are headed back to their homes. Good. And I finally convinced the mayor's office that making constituents homeless was not good for his poll numbers, so they won't be pulling that stun again. Spider-Man, good news. The mayor finally cracked the whip on Sable International. No more locking up New Yorkers without due process of law. Guess they figured out it was a PR disaster. For once, we got a clean win. Well, not quite. I hear rank-and-file Sable agents blame you for stopping the gravy train. They'll be gunning for you even harder now, and no one's going to stop them. By now, I think it'd freak me out more if nobody was gunning for me. Let them come. I'll be ready. No one my size, Hulk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Ryan, what's with the team up? I thought you were a loner. Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's rude to come in, right? What would you do if I didn't show up? Make him to give up? Yes, Duncan, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. Suit removed. What did Octavius promise you, Scorpion? Money. 
Gargan has no principle. He fights for profit. Untrue. I'd rip Spider-Man's face off for free. The money. Down. Now's my chance. Do you know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you freak show! might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. state and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be 
ready. Agents, this is Control. What's the situation near Carnegie Hall? Control, we've located the fugitives and are in pursuit. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Excuse me. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to uh, temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. Have people been waiting down here long? No, no. Only one or two hours. We all greatly appreciate Sable International's generous assistance with security. Has the penthouse been affected? Oh, my, no. The new security room in the back of the lobby ensures that the mayor remains totally undisturbed. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. You can't treat us like animals. If I get sick, I'll sue you into the ground. Let us upstairs before we all catch the disease. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Hey, let us back upstairs. I've got a medical emergency here. Oh man, I can't breathe. Let me back upstairs. How come Osborne never has to vacate his apartment for security sweeps? Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. That should do it. Oh, crap. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Get out here right now. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. Hello? Swear your way I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Okay. this thing. Gotta turn him around. Continuing sector sweep. What was that? Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. 
next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson, super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. But Stupid, useless button. Hmm. have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. What is this thing? Whoa. This mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. If Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to the secret keypad behind the family portrait? Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with the family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Self-diagnostic complete. No faults found. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norman. 
Karma could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? Harry kept a journal. <sighs> Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto. Pa Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. This room smells like rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Harry's room, but it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy, at least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Oh man, look at us. We used to be so carefree. I miss those days. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. Can't be for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney, like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum's ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. 
I've almost got the location. Sector sweep. What was that? Wait. July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Norman Osborne. GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure. I almost can't believe it. Spiders. Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis. Optical camouflage. What the hell is he trying to create? Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on.
What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Looks like a map of the Upper West Side. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Had no idea they owned so much of New York. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michael's. Dr. Strom, no movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must be out of the city. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building, but there's no security detail. This can't be- Don't think I've chosen the right categories. Bravo, bravo, bravo. And this must be the C team. Where do these three categories- Oh, good ol' Alpha team. Commercial buildings. Wow. So many records facilities. Nope, that's just a Sable Patrol. Oscorp's going all in on defense reasons. No, Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti-serum in a shopping center. A records facility- Oscorp's go- No, no Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath Lab. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. Good ol' Alpha Team. Oscorp building, Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. GR-27, that's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it! Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it! Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27, Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. Oh my god. Oh 
Armin and Otto. They started all of this. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. Who's there? Oh no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it. We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Need to clear that balcony. You are crazy. You're amazing. <laughs> 